See, I want this parameter to change, but I want it, I want to change it with a knob, and I want the change to be recorded. You know, rumor has it that when Pink Floyd recorded Dark Side of the Moon, there were actually a bunch of people around the mixing desk pushing and sending effects, pushing sliders and stuff. Each time the song had to be mixed down because these events had to occur in real time. And that is what we are going to do today. That's what we want to do. We want this parameter, the cutoff frequency or any parameter, to change at the touch of a button, we are going to use this control surface for that. I'm going to show you how to configure it and basically say, I want to use this knob to control this parameter. It's very easy to do. And then when we are happy with what we hear, we are going to automate that. And this is going to draw a nice curve moving the parameter along. Sounds good? Let's go. Now every plugin has two graphic user interfaces. This is the fancy one with all the buttons and the graphic controls and everything. And this is properties, the generic one. And this is where things happen in terms of automation. Just right click on the parameter we want to control. It's the VCS resonance. Right click on it and just turn the controller you want you want to use all the way in both directions. Let's check it. Now to record our button turning performance we are going to press the A button, make sure this is okay, select the parameter you want to alter and then click record and just play the song and turn the button. Thanks a lot. See you next episode. Keep on rocking the free world. Bye-bye.